Hi, this is Brendan from Watto Training, and in this tutorial, we take a look at crossroads with stop signs. And we'll take a look at a case study of how to negotiate them. So the question in this tutorial is, in which order can the vehicles go in this situation? We've got vehicle A, B, and C. So have a think about what order you think they would go, and then at the end of the tutorial, we'll come back and check the answer. Stop signs and stop lines. Stop signs and stop lines, continuous line, are used at intersections to control traffic. When you come to a stop sign, you must stop completely before reaching the stop line and as close as possible to the line. Where there is no stop line, stop before reaching and as close to it as possible to the intersection. A stop sign or a stop line means you must give way to all vehicles traveling in, entering or approaching the intersection whether vehicles are turning left or right or going straight ahead. You must give way to any pedestrian cross, pedestrians crossing the road into which you are turning. Giving way at a stop sign means the driver must remain stationary until it is safe to proceed. Observation and scanning skills. Drivers should scan, observe and monitor the driving environment in every direction as appropriate to the driving task. For example, in the QSAFE driving test in Queensland, it would be a critical driving error if the driver failed to scan and observe at an intersection with a control, such as a give way or a stop sign. Judgment. The driver must judge and utilize a safe gap in traffic when negotiate, negotiating intersections, lane changing or merging and without causing any road users to take evasive action. Make a correct decision and respond appropriately with regard to judgment of the speed and distance of any traffic or pedestrians. Signs and road markings. The driver must obey any regulatory road sign, traffic signal or road marking. The driver is required to bring the vehicle to a stop as close as practicable to but not over the line. Right turns. When turning right, signal right. Move as close to the center line as possible. Left turns. You must make a left turn from the left side of the road. When turning, signal left, move close to the left side of the road and keep to the left side of the road you are entering. As we've already stated, this is really important, give way to pedestrians. When turning left or right, you must give way to any pedestrian crossing the road into which you are turning. Okay, let's go back to our case study. In which order can the vehicles go in this situation? C, then B, and then A. Thanks for watching. This has been Brendan from Watto Training.